Okay, tonight we're going to test the Rocket Mass Heater Theory Pizza Oven. So here's the pizza that my wife has prepared. Doesn't that look yummy? I can't wait to sink my teeth in it. Even raw, I would eat it. But we're going to test the pizza oven. The pizza oven has been heating up for a little while, and we will go out there and we will start cooking the pizza. Okay, here's the... <laughs> Dude, be quiet. Okay. <laughs> Here's prototype number one, rocket mass pizza theory oven. We're going to test it tonight. If Duke will be quiet, I'll get a good video. But here's the oven. It's been heating up for a while. Um, I don't have a, I have a door cast, but it's not ready yet. There's bricks in the, uh, in the way. And we're going to, getting ready to put the pizza in, and we'll try it out, and we will let you know. So we have the pizza in the oven. So I'm going to put the bricks back in where the door is, it's supposed to be, and then we'll see how it cooks. Well, we gave the Rocket Mass Heater Pizza Oven a chance, and we've been out there feeding wood in it. And we thought maybe just like uh, getting too much ash on the pizza. You can see on the cheese, it's probably going to be really ashy, and I don't know how it's going to taste, but... Kathy thinks it's a little raw, so we're going to put it in the oven and try to cook it a little more. So that's uh, where we're at so far on the test of the first prototype rocket mash pizza oven. Okay, I'm doing another test of this rocket mash uh, theory pizza oven today. It wasn't working as good as I thought it was the other night, so I decided to check things out. And what I did discover was all of this uh, castable refractory cement was back there, kind of stopping things up, I think. It wasn't letting it draw good enough. It wasn't letting the grate go all the way to the back. I chiseled all of that out of the back of this firebox, and it seems to really be working a whole lot better. And besides that, uh, Here's the door that goes on the front of it that 